In the 2008 crisis, uh, Rahm Emanuel, who was the chief of staff of Obama, uh, said you shouldn't let a crisis go to waste. But they did let that crisis go to waste. We needed to reform our financial system. We needed to reform our, our economy. And we didn't. Uh, the money went to uh, the big banks. And uh, uh, we didn't get the money to the people who really needed it. What will we do with this crisis? Will this reinforce the ugly tendencies we've had for growing inequality, uh, for uh, corporate welfare, uh, or will it actually succeed in reforming uh, our economy? You know, it's remarkable. Uh, just a little while ago, people said we couldn't afford uh, uh, this program helping uh, college students with immense debt, or we couldn't afford providing uh, health care uh, for everyone. Uh, and all of a sudden, uh, the president is talking about a $1 trillion, $2 trillion bailout. We always could have afforded these things. Uh, it was just our prioritization was wrong. I think the point that this crisis makes clear is that we're all in it together. The virus doesn't discriminate, just like the virus uh, doesn't have a nationality. The virus doesn't discriminate on the basis of nationality, uh, of race, of religion. Uh, and so we're all in this together. So this is a moment, it should be a moment of national unity.